if you measure my, when you take the first drop step, you should be on his chin and take a second one. You're still doing it with body, not. You see people will go and shove this. Well, that's not very fun. But your issue is being there and touching his chin on the first drop step. If, if I get here and take another one, Joe don't like that. You know, or if I get all the way here and he don't like that. So get on his chin on the first one and listen, you can take this and go you do not have to go fast. The faster you go, the slower you learn it. And if you go fast, you are going to miss nuances that you can correct on your own. You can go, I'll do it this side. Oh, my center's pointing over this way. Now, I could probably still drop him, but that's not where I want to be. So now I can start correcting and take that step. But it's one, two, one, two. And if you look at it, I'm going down and up. Down and up. The slower you go, the faster you will get this. Because this is something that you need in your subconscious. If he jumps me, bam! You know, I don't have time to think about the diddly squat. It just pops up. And run through that. Okay, try that for a little bit. Thank you, Joe. Now.